Hey, New Tech, I hope you saw my other video where I introduced you to the Zion Benton Leadership Academy. This video is designed to show you some resources you can use to get a strong start in quarter two. So there's a trivia question at the end of this. If you email me with the answer, you can get in line for some prizes. So stay tuned for that. So I wanna share my screen and remind you about some resources. If you go to zbths.org slash ntzb or just ntzb.org, it'll take you to our homepage. If you scroll down to remote learning help, there's all kinds of stuff that can help you here. I wanna remind you, this schedule is a good place to start. I'm sure as you know by now in quarter two, classes are five minutes longer. The start time of each class has not changed and which periods are on which day has not changed, but the transition time between each class is five minutes shorter and each class is five minutes longer. So be aware of that. I also wanna remind you that your school day does not end at 1220 when classes end. Your school day ends at 224. So there are some things that you can do that your teachers really want to help you with between the end of class and the end of the school day. I'll come back to that in just a second, but I want to remind you that on Tuesdays at 1130, you have advisory. This is a class. You don't get a grade, but it's still a class and you need to be there. Advisory is a great opportunity to connect with your classmates and also your teachers. We discuss really important things, so make sure you're showing up for advisory on Tuesdays at 1130. On Thursdays at 1130, we have our academic intervention period. All of your teachers are sitting in a Zoom room, in a breakout room, waiting for you to show up so they can help you. So please make them feel useful. They're lonely. I'll show you how to get there. If you go back to the website into that remote learning help, look at number two, Oops, that intervention and academic support Zoom room. If you click that on Thursdays between 11 and 12, 15, you'll go to a Zoom room hosted by our very own Mr. Isaacs, and he will guide you to the breakout room that you need to go to. If you need to get help from one of your teachers, they're in a breakout room waiting for you. If you don't necessarily need to see your teacher, but you need help in math or reading or writing or something like that, we have teachers who can do that too. We have a room to help with SAT prep. We have a place that you can go just to get general homework help or just to know that somebody's watching you to make sure you do your homework. So please use that time. Don't fall far behind. Thursdays at 11.30. I also want to remind you that your teachers have office hours Monday through Thursday from one until 224. So remember I said that your school day doesn't end at 1220, it ends at 224. From one until 224, your teachers can help you one-on-one -on -one or in very small groups, either virtually or even in person. So if you need that one-on-one -on -one in-person interaction, you can get that during office hours. We'll even have buses pick you up. I'll come back to that in just a second. You can see your teachers virtually via Zoom Monday through Thursday from 1 to 224, you don't need an appointment. If you wanna come into the building, you do need an appointment. Freshmen and sophomore teachers are here on Mondays and Wednesdays in person. Junior and senior teachers are here on Tuesday and Thursday in person. So if you wanna see them, again, go back to this remote learning help website and click the booking calendar. It's really easy to use. All you have to do is pick who you wanna see. So let's say I wanna see Senor Reynoso on the 28th at 1.30. Then I just put my name and my email and click book and it'll send the teacher and me an email. Not me, you, you know what I mean. So you can be reminded of the appointment. Again, the, the thing that we're missing is just the in-person learning. And while we can't have entire classes come in, you can come in and get one-on-one -on -one help from your teachers. They're waiting for you. So please take them up on that. So on this, this remote help site, there's a document down here that says, here's a document with info and links all on one page. That can be a really helpful resource. You have all of the schedule information that I just went over. You have information about how to read your grade book. There's food service information. We are giving breakfast and lunch on campus. There's information about buses. As I mentioned before, we are running buses. So we'll do one bus run in the morning to bring you here by about eight o'clock so you can use our Wi-Fi and internet to do your classes. If you want a little bit more studious environment or like I said, use our internet and Wi-Fi, you can come here and do your classes. If you, <clears throat> if you don't wanna do that, 
you can do your classes at home and then take the bus to get here by one o'clock for office hours. And then there's buses that'll take you home too. So this will tell you exactly where and when the buses will be in your area. There's information about tech help. There's information for students and parents about accessing Skyward and Echo. There's a staff directory, really everything you need is on this one page. So I'll stop sharing my screen and I'll come back to you with my orange hair and everything. Um, Listen, I just want to remind you that you matter. You matter enough for us to miss you terribly. It's lonely without you here in the school, but you also matter enough for us to stay remote to keep you safe. You matter enough to make your teacher's day when you connect with them and they see that aha moment. And you just matter to us. And we miss you very much. We wish you could have you, we could have you back, but we're looking for ways that we can support you. So just know that we have your back. We wanna support you and uh, let us do that. Come to office hours, keep showing up to class on time. Try turning your cameras on. You don't have to, but that can really increase your connection and completely change the dynamics of your classroom. So remember your school day doesn't end at 1220, it ends at 224. So use office hours, use the intervention period, keep going to advisory, connect with your teachers. So here's the trivia question. After watching the other video with ZBLA, tell me what ZBLA stands for and what the purpose of it is. Students who email me that will be entered into a drawing to win prizes. So once again, the trivia question is what is ZBLA? You have to watch my other video for that. And uh, just email me with what it is and what the purpose of it is. And I'll get back to you if you're one of our prize winners. Hey, don't hesitate to call the office at 847-731-9800 or email me or any of our staff. We're here to help you. I will try to do videos as often as possible. Don't forget to rest of Red Ribbon Week. Stay safe and I'll see you next time. Bye, New Tech.